the training once we join as a full I mean as a pledge as a volunteers of the nonviolent environmental like actions we were trained by the experts and uh, master trainer how to face the consequence of the lati charge or how to face the first aid training how to conduct ourselves to a non-violent these are training that they imparted to us in the various uh, fields like for us in Maokar area they train us in the students field Maulai put on that Maulai football ground and here in Laibukrat um, that Laibukrat uh, playground, playground in Malki ground and many other place uh, grounds like in the whole state we were trained properly and we were instructed properly by the proper instructors. So was the inspiration from uh, Gandhi and uh, Martin Luther King uh, to go for Satyagraha yeah. way of agitation? Yeah, we were explained about that also. We were explained about the movement of Satyagraha during uh, Gandhiji. So because it was achieved without any bloodshed, no. so how could you sustain it 18 years? No, uh, it was not. Uh, it was not. Uh, it, it was not long. Long time. No, it was. It, it didn't take. It, it, we started in 1968, and by next uh, few months only, we we were declared uh, 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 sub state. We were declared at autonomous self state. How was the relation between the leaders and the volunteers? Leaders and volunteers, yeah, like what I said, uh, I had one occasion uh, because at that time the Mickey Hills and the North Kachil Hills were still a part of the FHLC. So one, at one point in time the, uh, there was a shortage of fund election fund because in 1967 the general election was announced so the FHLC also set up candidates and Mr. G.C. Hojai he was a can, he was a candidate of the FHLC so I was asked by Mr. S.D.D. Nikolsroy at the time I myself and Mr. Aslatan Lindor we both went to Haflong to hand over the election fund given by, by the party to Mr. Alexander Wadri, who was the election agent uh, control in charge of that area of these two districts. So we stayed there along with him and do this canvassing and all. Then we, but unfortunately, both the candidates lost, to, lost the election. And later on, Mickey Hills and North Kachir Hills, uh, they refrained themselves, they, they went back to Assam. They came out from the FHLC and they went back to Assam and attached themselves to the Assam till date. So this is the experience that we have been uh, connecting between our leaders and us. Whenever we uh, uh, there is a necessity, they call us as an errand, errand boy. So we go and help. We don't mind about that. So this is the attitude between the connection between our leaders. Of course, there are second rank, uh, second rank leader, leaders like Mr. Arwad Lingdor, Mr. Bremley Lingdor, Mr. Uh, There are so many. Uh, Teddy Pagantain, yeah, Teddy Pagantain, he was also there. And Mr. BM Pew, uh, sorry, uh, Archibald Pew. Archibald Pew, he was the professor of uh, Lady King College at the time. He in charge, uh, as a secretary in charge of the Mokher area unit. We are under him, actually. We are under him. So that means uh, separate duties were assigned to yeah. 
uh, many volunteers. Yeah. Mm. Uh, can you also tell us, uh, uh, there should be a sort of a monument to remember the unsung volunteers also, because leaders have got recognition, they became chief ministers, they became ministers, they became uh, known to everyone. Yeah, that is why I feel, that's why in the ninth, uh, nine, uh, 2018, I feel, I feel that uh, we were left right from nobody remember us. I mean, I didn't s sit here to ask for <laughs> acknowledgement what we did, because it is uh, like my parents, they used to tell us that it is the duty, it is your duty to help to help the uh, champion Rio, huh? what we call it, to help the state. So it is, I feel it is uh, duty bound for the future, I mean the present generation, you know, to remember those leaders, those leaders who have taken uh, the pain, they have sacrificed themselves, they have led us to this, uh, to this day. No? We, are, we are as a state as of now. It is because of the leadership shown by those leaders of the, of the past. There are people like Mr. Gigi Swell, who dream about to make this Meghalaya as a patch of beauty and a shining, shining of course of the Northeast. All right, Mr. Uh, Bibi Lingdo, who always told us that we would like to see that this state is free from corruption, free from uh, people who are drunkenness of power, no? And you, we, there's uh, some people like uh, Mr. Martin Naren Maja, who's of course my brother-in-law. He expressed to us at the time that we should have laws, we should have um, regulations to regulate, to protect our land, our property, our culture. These are the few leaders which I recollect that they showed us the way. 